Hey YouTube, welcome back to Kelly Science. In this episode, I will tell you how to become a notary public in the state of New Jersey, my home state. Let's go. Okay, so the first step, step number one, when becoming a notary public in the state of New Jersey is to complete the application online. And I'll put that link right here above me. Once you complete your application online, then it will go to your state representative, whether that be your assembly person or your state senator, wherever you live. Step number two, you got to pay your fees, right? Uh, the fees for New Jersey is if it's a paper application, if you print your application uh, and then mail it to your county clerk, the fee will be $25. If you process it online, there's an extra $5 charge to make that $30. So you'll either pay $25 or $30, depending on how you want to do it. Step number three. If and once it's approved uh, by the state, you will receive a certificate uh, for your commission and you will receive a oath qualification certificate. Usually, the only reason why you won't get approved if you have been convicted of a crime that had something to do with lying or anything uh, that was really major. So if, if you don't have any major criminal history, you'll be fine. Step number four, take your, uh, take your certificates to the county clerk's office within about three months. Anything outside of that, you'll have to start the process over again. And no one wants to spend 30, 25 to $30 every three, three and a half months. So just try to get it done <laughs> within three months. Step number five, uh, once you go within the three months, uh, you're going to go to your county clerk's office and they will administer your oath of office. Step number six, now you're a notary, now you have to get your supplies. So two of the most essential supplies to have is your stamp and your record book or your journal. Uh, once you get those things, anything else is a plus, depending on what you want to do, how you want to specialize, you know, you being a notary. Uh, the next step is, is errors and omissions, which is, again, optional. You don't have to get this, but it'll help if you do. That way, if you happen to either lose your stamp and somebody notarizes documents with or if you make an error while, while notarizing, notarizing documents, you'll be covered. And the last step, step number nine, is uh, any additional training that you want to have, any additional uh, information that you seek, you can find uh, websites like NNA, the National Notary uh, Association. I think it's uh, American Notary Association as well. And it's a bunch of others. Uh, there are a bunch of notary publics out there who have their own courses and things like that. They go over basic information uh, such as loan signing documents, immigration documents, and things like that. So that's how you become a notary public in the state of New Jersey. Uh, keep in touch for more videos. Thank you.